All right, here we're here with Melanie Linsky for Will Navarra Paris at South by Southwest. I'm Sarah Kaizak with the MacGuffin. Um, you have been on at least two times now with mm-hmm. the MacGuffin, so uh, Spencer is behind the camera rooting us on. Hi, uh, Spencer, <laughs> I missed you. I missed you all these months. <laughs> I mean, can you talk about your character? I mean, it's based on a real person, and she was th- there. She was the director. She was the director. Um, it was based on a real person, and that made me very nervous. Uh, but I had a lunch with them before we started, and she was like, don't try to do an impression of me. Yeah. Don't be worried about, you know, it's a character. You have to do something that feels comfortable. And I was very relieved about yeah. that. Yeah. So, I mean, you also got Simon Helberg. I mean, basically is him, but you're standing in for his wife, essentially. Yeah. So, I mean, was there any, like, uh, you know, expectations or anything like that you felt like you had to meet? Or just because of your meeting with, you know, Jocelyn, you, you felt like you could do your own thing? I felt okay about it. And I honestly, um, I don't think I would have put myself in a situation if I had any question about it. And they really both promised me um, that I would have a lot of autonomy and be able to make my own choices about it. And they wouldn't come in and be like, it was more like this. <laughs> And I also like have known them for so many years, and I was around when this happened, and mm-hmm. I knew enough about oh, wow. it, so that when I read the script, I was like, okay, things are different, things are changed, they're not going to be precious about making it exactly, you know, characters are, are different than they are in real life, um, which was another thing that made me feel okay yeah. about doing it. Yeah. Because I don't want to participate in someone's like weird you know revenge movie or some you know like it, and it was not that at all so um, I was grateful I mean you've been to South by Southwest before I believe no, no I had a movie here and I couldn't come oh, okay yeah so how has the experience been so far it's here? been so great I really really like it um there's a really nice energy here it feels like everyone's excited yeah um people are really drinking a whole lot <laughs> I've been sober this whole time. <laughs> just want to put that on the board, um, which has been nice. I yeah. think I'm the only person. Are you going to stick um, around for music at all? No, I have to go back to work. I got to work on Wednesday. Oh, awesome. yeah, crud. Um. Yeah. <laughs> it's like how Spencer's like just giving him running like commentary behind the camera. He's like, Boo. I told him he could do this, but no, uh, he didn't want He's to. He's sick of me. He's bored. I know. Bored at uh, this point. No. See, we need another camera on him. Mm-hmm. Um, I mean, talk about some of your, your work right now. I mean, you were in Perks of Being a Wildflower, which was honestly one of my favorite films of that year. Thank you. I get a lot of mean messages on Twitter <laughs> from people who, d- I guess, don't know. It's like you obviously looked at the actress's name and then yeah. looked her out, but they're like, how could you bastard? That was what I got yesterday. <laughs> How could you do this to Charlie? I was like, um, all right. But that's, I thought that was such a beautiful movie. Yeah. I'm really proud to be a part of it. And Two and a Half Men, are you still nope. chugging along on it? Or you're off? I was a regular for two years on that show. Okay. Not right. for the last nine years. Okay, yeah. awesome. Um, but I am on a new show. What is it? It is a show for HBO. Oh, it's okay. called Togetherness, and it is uh, created by the Duplass brothers. And we got picked up. <laughs> Yeah. So what's that one going to be about? Um, it's Love? about Steve Zissis. Steve Zissis, yeah. Steve Zissis is in it. Amanda Pete, Mark Duplass, and I play a married couple who have young kids. And life is fucking hard. Sorry yeah. for swearing. But life is really hard. It's hard to be in a relationship. It's hard to have a family. Yeah. And it's just kind of about that, but it's a comedy. Yeah. I mean, has it, what has it been like working on, you know, like a premium cable channel? Is there more freedom, you think, than... Oh, I've been naked already. <laughs> Completely naked. So I was showing everything. Everything. What about the everything. guys? Everything. My agent was like, uh, should I read you your nudity writer? Like, the things that they're saying you will show? I was like, I'm sure. Um, the guys also, yeah. Everyone's showing... Steve has not yet been naked, but everyone else has been naked. He will. So I've been the naked. Okay. No, Mark has been the nakedest. All right. Then me. All right. Well, thank you, Melanie, so much okay. for sitting down with us. <laughs> end, on that, end on that note. <laughs> nakedness. Nakedness. The wrath of Khan can't stop me. I'm on fire tonight. The board can't stop me. Because I've got space game and